there are more and more multiracial kids and families seen on TV ads. UGA professor Maria Lanerois says that is because the society has changed. She says the advertising agencies are smart and they adopt fast to the society changes. That is one of the reasons there are more multicultural people in advertisements. Offering the most powerful turbo four-cylinder engine in its class and performance Brembo brakes. The Cadillac ATS, every moment accelerated. In 2013, Cheers released a commercial that featured a multiracial family, but it backfired on the internet and they got so many racism comments that Cheers had to stop airing it. Whole grain oats that can help remove some cholesterol, nuts are healthy. But now, more and more commercials are featuring either a biracial couple or a biracial kid. I get look like there's something on the computer. <laughs> Emily Burden, an advertising NPR master student, says that this is a frequent topic in their classes. Such a touchy subject that um, you can often be offensive if you're targeting too obviously, or um, if you're not focusing on it enough on it, it can be considered that you're omitting people. Even though there are more commercials featuring multiracial family, there are still not a lot of people that approve of this image. Old Navy posted a picture on Twitter about upcoming sales. The image featured a multiracial family. Some people tweets were really supportive and sent images of themselves and their multiracial families. But some others said that the content of the image was inappropriate. Emily says that some ads could have done a better job dealing with the issue. But that is the past. She says now is the time to do it. I think they do it because it's such a sensitive time. The Pew Research Center says that there are at least 6.9 American adults that identify with at least two races. As the number of multiracial people increase, so do commercials. In 2012, there were only 12 commercials, and in 2016, there were 38. Tatiana Gusin, Grady News Source.